Hi, it's me again with Crow Dog Tips and Tricks. Last week, sometime I made a video on how to straighten up this sticker, and I used the perspective tool. And the gentleman that I did it for is trying to recreate it and doesn't have the perspective pool tool. So I clicked on the picture and I just I'm going to show you the perspective tool. I'm going to go to object, add perspective. This per perspective tool makes it life really easy. I'm trying to get that uh, green line, green corner in that corner of my red box. It takes a little bit of playing around, but you can get it and then take this one and uh, just a little bit of manipulation. But if you don't have the perspective tool, and then all you have to do is take this first and go intersect, and then it's going to intersect that and make it square. And you can see I didn't do quite well. You can do the exact same thing with the envelope tool. An envelope tool, I would think, is in everybody's corral. <clears throat> it's a little bit more difficult, but it can be done. So underneath your shadow flyout is your envelope tool. And when you do this, swipe through there and delete those inner nodes. This picture is quite large, and that's why it's taking a little while. And then select all four of these nodes and right-click and turn them into a line, make life a little easier. Then when you take your uh, envelope tool, see I, now it's like a line, and it's I should have made the, the subject a lot smaller because um, Corel's having to do a lot of work since the picture's 34 inches big, and we're almost there. But see, you can do the same thing with the envelope tool. Almost there. And that's good enough for the video. And then just select everything and go intersect. And what that did, that's going to cut out that label and make it square. I hope that helped him a little bit. Thank you for watching.